What is the concept of software prototyping? Software prototyping is the process of implementing the presumed software requirements with an intention to learn more about the actual requirements or alternative design that satisfies the actual set of requirements. Prototyping is commonly a means for validating the software engineer's interpretation of the software requirements, as well as for eliciting new requirements. As with the elicitation, there is a range of prototyping techniques and a number of points in the process where prototype validation may be appropriate. Process of prototyping Determine key requirements including the input and output information desired. Details, such as security, can typically be ignored. The initial prototype is developed that includes only key parts of the system. Typically the initial approach to architecture is suboptimal and during the implementation of the first version better ideas surface. That's why it is of paramount important that architects were part of the prototype implementation team and feel the heat of selected approaches to system design. Prototyping of the software process Evolutionary prototyping is an initial prototype is produced and refined through a number of stages to the final system. Throwaway prototyping as a prototype is produced to help discover requirements, problems and then discarded. The system is then developed using some other development process operational prototyping used when requirements are either critical and understood or not critical and poorly understood. Throwaway prototypes are selectively built on top of evolutionary prototype. Benefits of software prototyping It makes the developers clear about the missing requirements lets the developers know what actually the users want reduces the loss by bringing the manufacturer to a conclusion whether the system which we are about to build is feasible or not rather than building the whole system and finding it. One can have a working system and beforehand. It brings the user to get involved in the system design, 